What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel, welcome to another Pokemon Sword and Shield VGC video. You guys all seem to enjoy that uh, Buzzwool uh, ladder tour, or not ladder tour, that Buzzwool uh, room tour video. Uh, so I figured I would record another one. I actually just won a room tour with my um, with my uh, Morbius Orbius team. Uh, and yeah, I, I think uh, I figured I, I might as well just hop in and record another one. So yeah. If you guys enjoyed this at any point in time, do me a favor, leave a like in the video, subscribe to the channel, and turn notifications because I bring you daily VGC content. And answer my comment question of the day, what bug type do I build next? Because I have been building bug types like crazy. Let's see if we can uh, secure a win here. I'm going to go ahead and actually lead off with uh, Orbius and... Uh, I mean, Orbius Veltal seems like a really solid lead here, but Regieleki is also kind of nice in case they want to lead off with their... Um, in case they want to lead off with their their guy here, their uh, Thunderous. So I think I'm gonna do this. I can actually go that mode. That's gonna be a little risky. Uh, hopefully I can actually get pretty far into this tournament because last time I took second um, when I recorded a video um, and hopefully this time I'll just take first. Also, yesterday I uploaded a video with a Morbius meme like a uh, thumbnail, you know, it, it's like that template where you just take Morbius and like substitute the left half or something else. Uh, and as it turns out, our, our good friend on the internet, that's uh, also uploaded a video with a similar thumbnail uh, the day before. And a lot of people are like, ah, you stole his thumbnail. Uh, clarification, no, I didn't stop being weird. And yeah, that's all I'm going to say about that. Uh, so I have a couple of options here. We do see it's life orb. However, I just got intimidated, which isn't great. Um, but I'm fairly certain what they're going to want to do here is go for an airstream into me. And I think if I just go for like a helping hand max lightning, I should be fine here. Even though I'm intimidated, this should do a decent chunk. Uh, let's see if I get faked out. I'm assuming I am. He fakes out the Reggie Lucky. That's fine. Let's go for this max lightning. If he goes for an airstream, I actually knock him out next turn, but I do lose the ability. Uh, to go for another one of these bad boys. So that kind of sucks. However, uh, I'm in a pretty prime position just to start being really annoying. Uh, let's go ahead and I should be able to KO him with a uh, helping handed airstream. And that'll keep me faster. Helping hand airstream. That also catches a possible like Groudon switch in. Um, and this should KO. I'm, pre I'm pretty certain this will KO. He goes for a max guard as he parting shots out. Still in a pretty decent position, to be honest. Let's see what comes out. It's going to be the Grim Snarl. Um, that's fine by me, honestly. I'm still just going to get my Kyogre in, and I don't think Airstream KOs from this range. We can just Lightning, though. Yeah, I'll just Lightning, and we'll go for a special one, just because, you know, it's a little, a little safer since I'm at half health. Ooh, okay, he's going to half my speed. That doesn't quite KO me though, and I do <laughs> I do keep my Aleki, which is going to be very awesome for the end game. Uh, Groudon can come in and be a little bit annoying here. However, um, we did see they have Scary Face. Honestly, I'm not terribly concerned here. I want to keep around... Do I want to keep around my Aleki? Is that really important? I don't think it is. They don't have a Trick Room option. Uh, I'll actually go ahead and just switch out this guy here, and I don't really need to keep Aleki, yeah. Let's just go for an Electroweb to, I guess, oh, I guess we can just Wild Charge, why not? We'll Wild Charge into the Grim Snarl here. I'm going to get Scary Faced. I'm immune, though, because Prankster uh, does not affect Dark Types. Let's see me lose my Aleki. Very awesome, very awesome. Now, here what I'm going to do is something a little bit controversial. I'm going to get in Kyogre. I'm going to get in Kyogre, and obviously, obviously, you know, this isn't the best situation because Kyogre can get Scary Faced. Um, don't care. Let's go ahead and go for the Oblivion Wing and a Grim Snarl and switch in Orbius. One would assume they're just going to go ahead and go for like, you know, Scary Face or Screens or something. Uh, yeah, those Screens shouldn't be too annoying now because I can just go for Helping Handed Oblivion Wing. Uh, or I could even attempt a Hypnosis, but I think Helping Handed Oblivion Wing is much more useful. Because the whole point here is to make sure that I get in my Kyogre second. All right, awesome. He goes for the rock sled, that's fine. Um, I can lock myself into Origin Pulse here and I'm kind of in a good situation. We're just gonna go for the Dark Pulse, Origin Pulse play. Hopefully I don't miss anything. It could be very annoying if I do. They're gonna fake out obviously, but uh, I have a chance to Dark Pulse flinch. Oh, he gets a crit. That's gonna suck if I actually get KO'd here. All right, flinch. Let's go. Okay, that should be game-ish. 
I can actually lock myself into Water Spout now. There's not too much of a risk. It's still stronger than Origin Pulse, and I actually have a pretty decent chance of KOing this Groudon. Izzy goes for the Protect. That's fine. I'm going to get this Incinera to like half health. Yeah. You can go for like a Snarl or whatever. I'm fairly certain I still win. Yeah. Uh, so let's go for the... Actually, let's Oblivion Wing just to be a little bit safer. Uh, get me some health back. Because next turn after this, I can go for Dark Pulse and then KO. Oblivion Wing will just get me some decent health back. As it looks like it's just going to wrap up the game. Oh no, there's a Citrus Berry, I forgot. Uh, but I do have Sucker Munch, so regardless of what happens, I'm in a winning position. Rock Slide, let's go ahead and go for the Sucker Punch as well as a Water Spout. And that should be game. GG, well played. Nice. Played very bad. Nah, you played fine. You played fine in my opinion. Alright, um, next up we're facing Monite9. Oh, this is a scary team. This is actually a very scary team, but you know what? It's got nothing for the Orbeus. You might think, Marcos, what are you going to do here? They got so many Orbeus answers. No, they don't. They don't, because tell me, what do they do if I just lead off Yveltal in Orbeus and land my Hypnosis? It's that simple, guys. It's that simple, but you don't get it. You just don't get it. All right, let's go ahead and bring the Kyogre uh, and the Incineroar. Oh, it's it really is just that simple, guys. It seriously is that simple. Let's go for the... Uh, actually, you know what? There's a simpler way to do this. Their Chesto Berry. Let's just Struggle Bug because I am fast. Struggle Bug can't miss, right? Yes, because I am going to be faster than my Eveltal. That's actually a very specific thing I wanted to do here. And we're going to go for a Max Darkness into you. As it looks like they just want to go for the immediate Shadow Sneak, uh, that's fine. I'm pretty sure I'm faster than the Solgaleo. Let's go ahead and break that. Uh, they're going to lose the opportunity. I mean, they could Max Lightning me, which would be very bad. But I can Helping Hand a Water Spot next turn if I survive. Or Oh, wow, that actually didn't KO. That's concerning. They're going to Max Rockfall me. Um, Yeah, I'm still pretty sure I can win this. Do I need to Helping Hand anything? I don't think I do. Do I have to hold on to... I might need to hold on to my Eveltal, to be honest. I may need to hold on to my Eveltal. In fact, it might be a it might be a pretty decent investment to go for Hypnosis on the Solgaleo and Airstream here. I'm going to do it. You know, this is a risk. I could Helping Hand, but I don't want to lose my Eveltal yet. Like, if I lose my Eveltal, I'm probably going to lose to Gastrodon, which is the main issue here. Um, but I could just Helping Hand a Dark Pulse. That is also an option. But then if they Trick Room, I lose. So let's do this. 60% chance to win. There we go. Now the naysayers in the in the crowd may be saying, Moxie boosted. You're not playing the game. You're just landing hypnosis. And to which I would reply, yeah, stinky. Uh, let's go ahead and go for a... <laughs> uh, like I said, I, I need to get rid of this Gastrodon before anything else. Let's just target it down with a helping handed um, Max Darkness. So Galio is going to stay asleep because I demand it to be so. Right? Right, buddy? Yeah, you're a sleepy boy. Okay. Um, and here, uh, what I can actually do is... I'm still in a position where I get so much out of just doubling down this Gastrodon. So we're going to Helping Hand and Max... Uh, and, and just Dark Pulse, because... You know, I'm not fair. I'm not certain that an Oblivion Wing would do it from this range, even Helping Handed. The Gastrodon's got that fat bulk, and uh, they stay asleep for three turns, so I'm pretty sure we win. There's Cali Ice. Um, and in this position, I, I just go for this Galio. So we're going to Helping Hand this Dark Pulse. Hopefully it'll KO. They Protect. Awesome. They're probably going to go for Trick Room with the Solgaleo. GG. Well played. Alright, and now we Helping Hand the Dark Pulse on Calyrex Ice. And that there was a hashtag Morbius Sleep. Okay. How far are we in the tour? Uh, oh, we're already in... <laughs> this going to be a quicker... This is going to be a quicker one than the last time. It was a bigger tour last time. That's a Durant. What fresh hell did you pull Durant out of? That's concerning. I, I honestly don't know if I can deal with Durant. It's actually really scary, especially... Oh my god, and they have a... I don't know what happens here. All right. Um... I still lead off Orbeus. I just bring Regieleki now. 
Uh, and, uh, Kyogre, he's pooping. And do I bring Eveltal? I think I have to bring Eveltal. Yeah. So we see eject button. And we see mystic water. Uh, will he hit me with that nasty tailwind? I don't live a water spout. I think I have to go Eveltal. Do I hand over? I think I hand over my guy. I'll struggle boat here and I'll just hand over my guy. Let's try to wild charge. I'm gonna get water spouted. Orbius, why? Why Orbius? Why you gotta hit me with that? All right. Uh, I mean, I can't get forced out now, so that's kind of cool. Let's just go for the Scarf Thunder. Locking myself into Thunder doesn't seem like that bad of an idea, unless of course they bring out that Crocodile. Uh, and we'll go for Airstream into you. This is probably the end of the road for me, guys. This is this is most likely the end of the road for the for the hashtag Orbius sweep. Unless I get a full para here, that'd be very cool. Helping hand, am I gonna get helping hand thundered? No, I should live that pretty easily. Okay. Alright. Alright. Thunder. Para. Okay, well, I didn't get that, but uh I'm still scarfed. I should be faster than Durant. Let me think. So Durant 177. Uh, times two, that's 344. Yeah, we're faster, so I'm actually gonna do this. Come on, Kyogre, get that nasty para. Oh god, he hit me with it. All right, um, that's not great. Scald, that's not great. Airstream, I should be... I'm slower now. I'm slower now, I'm still slower. 298, oh, this is the end of the... That's the end of the Morbius sleep. GG. Orbius has perished. Dang, man. Okay, so, you know, we lost the room tour. We did, you know, we got, we got two wins and then we lost the room tour. Ah, man. Okay. Times like this, I wish it was double a limb so the video would go a little bit longer. Um, but I mean, we might as well just grab a few games for fun. Why not? Let's, let's grab like two, three games. All right. Um, so here I actually quite like uh, Orbius plus Regieleki on lead. Deals with a lot, surprisingly. Uh, we're going to go ahead and bring the Velt on the back because it's very good here. And let's go Kartana. Sash Kart doesn't seem bad either. So some changes I made since the last time I made, um, or since the last uh, Orbital Live. Um... Regieleki now carries Protect over Assurance, and Kartana carries Protect over Sacred Sword. Okay, uh, a little bit concerned that I'm going to get... That's Eject Button, okay. Well, they know that I know they have Eject Button. I think it's in my best interest just to go Eveltal. And... Okay, I'm going to be faster than them. Unless they Tailwind, and I die if they Tailwind. So I'm actually just going to Airstream... Whimsicott and deal with the consequences later. Because I still get a speed boost on my on my Alecky. Okay. That's fine. I'm gonna get the speed boost. They don't get to eject button me. And I actually think I like this positioning. Um Zashin can come in. I still get like a sucker punch. Oh, it's Thunderous. Okay, well, I'm actually faster than Thunderous. 415 times 179. I, I'm pretty sure I'm faster. Let me think. So that's 29 times... Tw or 29 plus 29. That's like 54. So that's uh, 354. So I'm still faster. So let's actually just go for the... Actually, I think this is safe. Um, or do I Airstream them? I think I might just need to Airstream the Calyrex and Sucker Punch. And just secure that ASAP. Because then I'm going to be faster than the Satia when it comes out. I failed. Okay, they're just going to Will-O-Wisp me. But they fail. Okay, that's fine. 
I get my airstream in a crit. So far, this isn't going terrible. Um, I'm going to be faster than their Calyrex this turn, so I can actually airstream and try to land a Hypnosis. And if I land this Hypnosis, it's all over. Uh, for those of you screaming in the comments right now, you can't land a Hypnosis when they're in an electric train. They're flying, so it doesn't matter. A lot of people ask me that, like, why'd you do that? You silly boy. They're going to airstream into Orbeus, not knowing that Orbeus is the most busted Pokemon ever. And now I'm going to land. Check it. Be oh, okay. Um, see, I revealed physical, which is a little concerning here. I don't know if they KO me. I have a couple of options. Um, I can do a helping handed wild charge and KO the Zacian right now. But they might be able to KO my Regieleki, which is what sucks. However, next turn I will be faster. Let's just go for it. Let's go! <laughs> That's an Orbeus sweep, baby. Okay, uh, yeah, I can just go for the Leaf Blade into Wild Charge and that'll do it. GG, well played. Uh, they don't have any outs here. Awesome. Cool, cool. So that's going to be a W. Let's get another one. Okay, uh, PZ. Dude, there's been a lot of, like, eject button whimsicott on ladder recently. recently. Um, and that can be kind of frustrating. And I maybe it's just that I'm using Frisk on my Orbital, so I notice it more. That could be the issue. Maybe I'm just noticing it more. Uh, but I don't know. It could be a lot of things. I actually think I want to go Orbeus and Eveltal here, and then these guys in the back. Okay. That one's Focus Sash. And that one's Life Orb. I'm AV, so I can actually eat a hit. Let's let's attempt a Hypnosis and an Airstream. I could also go for Struggle Bug. Let's Struggle Bug and Airstream, because that'll kill the Whimsicott. Oh, but do I want that? I don't think I want that, actually. The more I think about it, the more I don't want that, because Zacian comes in and revenge kills me. Yeah, I think I... Yeah, I think I'm always going to go for Hypnosis here. And Airstream the Worms got. If they helping hand, I should just barely live, because I'm Dynamax Eveltal with an Assault Vest. Uh, but, yeah. They're going to Dynamax. Don't take out my Orbeus, I'll cry. He took out Orbeus. He, 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 he really hit me with that. Oh my god, okay. Um, am I going to be faster with Regieleki? It's 277, 156. No, I'm not. I can, however. I can, however. I kind of wish I brought the cart now. All right. I think I need to leave this thing in the back. Because they got three turns of Tailwind. It's in my best interest to protect here. Airstream U. Yeah. Oh, is this going to KO? No. Okay. Got some decent damage there. Let's go for an Electroweb and another Airstream. I'm gonna lose my I'm gonna lose my Whimsicott or not my Whimsicott, my Veltal this turn if they helping hand, which they probably will. Basically, my goal here is to manage to get on the field with Zacian and Groudon, and have these guys be gone. But I don't think I'll be able to do that. Oh wait, hold on, I might be able to. This this, this might work because I now have Sucker Punch and Sucker Punch may KO Porygon. And that was their third turn of Dynamax. This might be doable. Okay. Actually, I mean, I'm going to get outsped by the Zacian, so I have to lock Origin Pulse here, and I have to Sucker Punch you. And that, I think that'll do it. I have, like, no attack investment, but it is Dark Aura boosted. And Porygon Z is not super bulky. All right, I do KO. Let's see. And I'm probably gonna lose here. Actually, wait, wait, that was single target. I might be able to, I have to like crit the grout on here is all. Oh, the Zacian lived, okay. That's not great. They're gonna miss a play rough though. That's a that's an SLC moment. It's a classic SLC moment. And now if I can connect 
If I connect this and they miss their P blades, I win. Okay, I lose. <laughs> oh man. Okay, that's fine. GG. GG. All right. Let's get one more. Win or lose, this has been a fun Orbius session. Honestly, if you guys are down, I might end up bringing Orbius to um, if it's still funny. When when Milwaukee regionals come around, I'll bring Orbius. I, I will bring Orbius. Okay. Uh, versus whenever I see a Zapdos on lead, I actually always go Orbius Regieleki because it's very easy to take games off a of Zapdos uh, on lead if they are just a little bit too comfortable uh, using it. Uh, here, I'm gonna bring Eveltal Kartana because I don't want to lose to uh, Rillaboom. Yeah. Okay. This is pretty much what I want. Um. Helping Hand, Max Lightning should do it. I could get rid of Zacian early, but it's actually much better to get rid of Zapdos early, I think. Is it? Maybe I get rid of... Yeah, I get rid of Zapdos early. Or I can do something much riskier. I can do something so much riskier. You know, it's the last video. It's it's the last game of the video. Let's, let's just do something much riskier for fun. All right, go to sleep. Oh, uh, Orbius, you gotta fail me now. You really gotta fail me now, Orbius. Uh, the good news is the Zapdos is in range of Max Lightning, but... Um... Oh, man, do I Helping Hand Max Lightning? I think I just Helping Hand Max Lightning and get rid of that, and then I can put Zapdos to sleep next turn. I revealed Physical here, so they might be a little bit more cautious, but Helping Hand Max Lightning should take pretty much anything but Rillaboom. Um... Let's see. They don't Dynamax. Let's see if they land a Hurricane on my Orbius. Hey, they could also just Thunderbolt. That's fine. Okay. All right. I'm going to go for Max Lightning on Zapdos, and we're going to attempt to KO on Zacian here with Smart Strike. I don't know if it'll do it. I've been playing this so irresponsibly, I must be honest. <laughs> I, I know I said, hey, we're going to do something really irresponsible for the last game of the video, but I, I, I mean, I, I, maybe I should have, maybe I should have just gone with my gut. Okay. So they got rid of my terrain. Um, this isn't going to KO, but I'm still going to be faster than this Zapdos. I go for a Protect here. Um, and Wild Charge will KO. However, they could obviously protect, which would not be poggers. So perhaps it's in my best interest to double protect, but it's it's pretty risky to do that. We'll just we'll just attack. All right. So in this situation, uh, I just sucker punch the Zapdos, and I can go for a bounce on the Rillaboom, but. Even that's pretty risky. Uh, what's Zapdos' speed? 167. That's going to be faster than me. I'm going to Sucker Punch Zapdos. Pretty sure we lose this now. Just off of uh, <laughs> me being dumb and the yeah, I get static. There's the U-turn. They fail the U-turn, which means I can KO them with this bounce since it's Life Orb, I think. Um, but Zashin in the back is going to be a huge issue, as well as the fact that there's probably still a, you know, a Kyogre or something. Yeah. Let's go for the Dark Pulse. In the bounce. That's gonna KO. Let's see if I somehow tank this. You with Blade. Yeah, that's game. Okay. <laughs> I tried to I tried to flex with Orbius today, and it just it, it wasn't today was not Orbius's day. Let's be real. Today was not Orbius's day. But is it Orbius's year? I would say so. I would say so. We still had fun though. I think this was still a fun session, and it's it's still a fun team, but yeah. Um, won the room tour off camera, start recording, lose the room tour, but it's, it's whatever, you know, if you guys enjoyed, leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, uh, and turn on notifications because I bring you daily content, uh, and, uh, comment, uh, hashtag Orbius sleep in the comment section down below, even though we didn't quite pull it off today, comment Orbius sleep just, just for the culture, but yeah, have a nice one guys. Bye.